Hey, I haven't made a video like this in a long time, and this is something you're going to have to see to believe, but I ask you this before we get into the video. What would you do if you were in this exact situation? Because all I can say is this is one of the craziest things that um I've I've seen. I feel like people just don't care anymore, bro. People just don't give a fuck anymore, dog. So uh let's go ahead and check this out together and you guys let me know what you think. Well, I caught you lying, you got mad. I did. Okay, and then what and when you got mad, you went and fucked somebody else. I was mad at me. Wow. Okay, so two things, right? He said he caught her lying and she got mad, and then she went and literally fucked somebody else. And she's like, yeah. <laughs> what, bro? Okay, but you went and fucked somebody else. I did. Because you got caught lying. Yes. And now this person is now. Because I was mad at me. Now this person is now texting you saying that he was with you actually all night. He was not. Okay, but so. He Dude, how is this man so patient? His patience is over 1,000. He's having a whole ass interview with her. Bro, she looks, I'm not, you guys let me know what you think in the comments down below, but I feel like she does not care. She's on the couch, not remorseful at all. She's kind of curled up because I feel like she's just guilty. Like this whole pose is like a guilt pose right here. I I, I can't believe what I'm watching. I had to share this with you. What? He's lying. He is lying. Okay. He is lying. That's a big fat fucking lie. He's saying. So she's saying that the guy is lying, that he spent the entire night with her. But then she, of course, admits that she, she like, you know, s slept with him, did whatever. I, it doesn't necessarily, the, the fact that he, whether or not the guy stayed with her all night, that doesn't matter. That's not important. She cheated on her husband, bro. <laughs> hey, last Friday night, last Friday night. What does Katy Perry voice mean? I have no idea. Oh, the last Friday night song. We were da 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 da. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, my God. I don't know what he's talking about. So he's lying. I think he was with somebody else before he got to me. That's what I think. Okay, all right. And it doesn't make your situation any better. You cheated. What the fuck? Guys, 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 listen. I feel like at this point, <laughs> everybody might as well be in a polyamorous relationship because it just seems like it's going to happen. It's inevitable at this point. Like th this right here, bro, she doesn't care, bro. She doesn't care, bro. Like looking at this is like do relationships with commitment levels do they even exist anymore, bro? Like this this right here is just oh my god. Knife in the chest. Look. Okay. Well, he thinks he had sex with you all night. He didn't. Did you blow him near the couch? Yes. Do you hear this? Did you blow him near the couch? She says, yes. Wow. Okay. Well, he talked right when he walked in the door. Okay, so wait. Right when he walked in the door. Look at look, ex look at how she explained it. She's like, right when he walked in the door. Uh-huh. Right when you walked in, you went out sucking his dick. Yes. Okay. Well, he reckoned he... he re look at her face, bro. What's, what's having me a little bit mildly, like, just puzzled right now is how, like, nonchalant she is with this. She doesn't care. I mean, she looks like she's probably probably in her like upper 40s, early 50s and stuff like that. She's probably been through a lot in her marriage and stuff, but it doesn't excuse cheating, bro. And she looks like she's just, bro, caught in 4K. I don't know how this man caught her, but she definitely got, uh, the, she gets the big L for the week. References that. So he's ta he knows it's you. Yeah, okay. He's talking about being with you all night. He wasn't. Yeah. We didn't leave the restaurant until 10.30. You just okay. heard that. Okay. Well, there was but, nothing but, but, to preface but, 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 but that. But she didn't say that you weren't with him as well. Call her back. She probably won't take the call since you hung up on her, but go ahead and um, call but her do back. You, okay, now, do you feel bad at all that you did what you did? That's what we're all wondering. Do you feel bad at all? What the hell, bro? Oh my God. What, Fuck yes, I do. What do you feel? Do you, oh my God, bro. Spot. I'm dead, bro. <laughs> oh my god, of course. I feel so bad. Like, oh my god. I feel so bad. Oh, oh. You could hear the remorse in her voice, man. Honestly, if she said that just how she said it one more time, I think I would probably shed a half of a dust bunny. Bad about. I feel bad that 
Well, for a hundred different things, I feel bad. She feels bad that she got caught. Come on. That's ex that's all it is. She feels bad that she got caught. She feels bad that the dude that she was with probably snitched on her and him having a little thing. Because what typically happens when you cheat, right, in a lot of situations, and you can correct me in the comments down below if I'm wrong, right? You cheat. And then the whole thing is you're, you're obviously a lot of people cheat and stuff because they're missing something in the relationship that they want and they, 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 they love the thrill of a new person, right? And that's great and it's wonderful until the new person thinks that it's okay to take the person, the, to take you out of your relationship. Like, hey, I think that me and you should go exclusive and you should leave your main partner. And that's where things go downhill. And I think that's what happened. I don't have all the details, but ladies and gentlemen, oh my God starting backwards or starting at the end and working backwards i felt absolutely terrible that i cheated on you wow mm -hmm. she yep. bro not a tear shed this is worse than any youtuber apology i've ever seen in my life this is bro bro oh my god she might as well have just left him i i, I think she should have just completely left him and that would have been it this is so bizarre this is such a bizarre oh my god well did, did you feel bad that you lied to me well oh. i was getting there i told you i was working from the end and going backwards okay wow the worst thing that i've ever done is hurt you okay, so <laughs> She's a comedian. Oh, that's why they got married. That's fucking hilarious, dude. That's the most boneless response I've ever heard in my yo. But she, she's for, for the streets. She's for the streets. Just, oh my god. Pack your bags and go to the streets. That's just, oh my. Uh, that's such a boneless excuse. The worst thing I've ever done was hurt you. Yeah, I sucked his dick the second he walked through the door. What? <laughs> but so when you when you. When you got so tell me more about the, the guy is so baffled at her response too that he can't even keep it straight, bro. I can't even keep it straight, and I'm a spectator. We're all spectators to this hot, fiery mess. What is going on? Logic of you fucking getting caught lying, and then you go suck some other guy's dick because I caught you lying. How how does that work, bro? That's so crazy, right? He caught her in a lie. She felt guilty that she got caught and then she went and go fucked somebody because she was mad at him for catching her in a lie. It makes zero sense. It's like the most vindictive, random shit I've ever, oh my God, what the fuck? All right, whatever. Like, I was an absolute whore and deserved to be treated like one. It was <laughs> <laughs> self-mutilation. I don't know how to behave like bro leave her leave her leave her leave her that's it that's the end of the video um word of advice to this dude if he ever sees any of the reviews watching this i'm pretty sure everyone's saying the same thing leave her bro leave her it's she's probably done this a billion times if bro it, it, <laughs> if all it took was you catching her lying one time and then she like hops on a pole and you know takes it for a hot minute and stuff and gets caught like this bro just leave her bro she's she's not for you man but i'm glad at least he, he threw something up on the internet for some internet you know history because she definitely she is 100 percent for the streets and hey she said she deserves to be treated like a little street person so by all means <clears throat> i pass this on over to you guys that have witnessed this abomination what do you think of this scenario what would you do what would you do if your partner did this shit to you would you forgive him would you get down to the bottom of this would you leave i don't know I feel like it depends on the response. Now, a lot of people would say they would instantly leave. She had zero remorse, bro. If you looked at her face, it's like, she's like, yeah, mm -hmm. I did it. Um, you caught me lying and I got mad and I slept with blah, blah, blah. And yeah, that's, that's it. Subscribe. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Take care.